Hey y'all, this is Tony at Creative Chica Shops and Hauls, and um, I figured, well, I just went to Walmart, I just got my pedicure done, and my tootsies feel so much better, but anyway, so I went to Walmart to just pick up a few things, and I wound up spending, spending like <clears throat> $87, and I didn't get a whole lot, to be honest, okay, so I picked up these maple griddle cakes, and I figured, hey, you know what, these sound good, I think they were six something, so I got those, and then I got these for my hubs. Sometimes if I'm really hungry in the mornings and I don't want cereal or something, I'll grab me one of these. And they're not bad, really. They're not too bad. So I picked up those. Those were probably, I have no idea, 12 or $13. Okay, so I did pick up two jars of the Thick and Chunky Salsa. Great value. Now, these jars have actually shrunk. So what do they call it? What did they call this? It, something deflation. Something. I don't know. Anyway. So, yeah. It's ridiculous. So, anyway. I got some Chahula. Cholula. <laughs> Cholula. Um, we had some the other day. Uh, we were out eating somewhere. Oh, I know where it was. Wendy's. We got some of their burritos, which are delicious. And they had some little packets of this. And I said, oh, we should get some of these because it's really tasty. And, you know, plus whenever my oldest son comes over to visit, he has breakfast with us, with the boys. And uh, he likes that. While I was there, I noticed that they had a whole bin full of this stuff. This is called uh, Melinda's Ghost Pepper Wing Sauce. And these were a dollar for two fluid ounces. They had a whole bin of them. I guess it's for barbecue season. So I picked this one up for a dollar for my son. His birthday's coming up, so I'm going to give this to him as well. Sweet habanero pepper sauce. Look at that. Woohoo! He loves hot sauce now. And then this one here is called Marie Sharp's habanero pepper sauce. And then this one here is the Marie Sharp's, um, what's it say? What you say here? Nopal green habanero. So I'm going to just put that in with this t-shirt. Um, we actually uh, ordered him a, a tree off of Amazon that um, has, um, what are those called? Some kind of berries on them that he likes. They're, they're mulberries, I think. I think they're mulberries. So he's going to grow him another tree. We already gave him one three years ago, and it has gotten so big, and the kids pick them clean. They love them. Okay, so I've got two pies for the hubs for the rest of this week. He only works till Thursday. Blueberry and cherry. And these are probably 74 cents. I got a thing of bananas. I got them little cakes for strawberry shortcake, because, you know, we like us some strawberry shortcake around here. Then I bought some cinnamon because, you know, cinnamon's good for you. So I got me some of that. And then I picked up the dog some of these. Uh, I haven't been able to find the kind of little, um, they're called dream bones, I think, or something like that. Um, they're too expensive at Walmart. I'm not paying that, so I'll just get them these. They, they, won't, they, won't, they won't mind. And plus, this is a product of the U.S. I hey. So it's Purina Baggin Flavor uh, Sticks. These are like $3.48, and then I got them the uh, bacon, and, you know, that's going to be their little treat. Then I got some strawberries, and guys, you know, like, I tried to make sure that there wasn't a lot of white. See, there was some white on there, but that's okay. Um, I'll just still cut them up and eat them, but they're so good. Try to get the ones that, you know, it's kind of hard, though, to be honest, to get your strawberries where they're all red. I got some um, whipped topping for the strawberry shortcake. Um, I did buy two of these Tostitos Hint of Lime. I got two for our house and two for my husband to take to work next week for Cinco de Mayo. They're going to have like a little dinner celebration. Um, my husband, he's excited. He said he's going to say the prayer in Spanish and English. So, yeah, he's excited about that because he has all kinds of decorations for Cinco de Mayo. Okay, guys, so I came across this. And I almost put it back, but then, you know, I said, well, I don't know. But um, it's cute. It's a Polly Pocket. It's a gumball machine. I am a sucker for gumball machines. This was on clearance for $11, and it's regularly $33.97, guys. $33.97. Well, they, she had a hard time getting this um, 
tag on here, but it was regularly $33.97. I wouldn't pay that much, but for $11, I said, yep. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to take all the tape off of it, and then I'm going to use it for my beads, but I'm probably going to have to plug this up down here, and then all the little toys I'll just put in the bottom, and then one day, whenever I'm tired of it, I'll just go ahead and donate it, you know what I'm saying? But I love little teddy bears. I love teddy bears. They're so cute. So yeah. So anyway, guys, that's going to be all of my Walmart haul, and I do appreciate everybody for watching. Please give me a like. That helps my channel to grow. And um, please subscribe if you're not subscribed. Anyway, I will catch you all in my next video. Hope you have a wonderful day. Bye. If I can turn it off, guys. If I can turn it off.